Hello guys, my name is Bob. Welcome to the Excel Math Channel. And today, um, in this video, I'm going to um, teach you guys how to conduct or how to perform priority sorting. So that means sorting um, based on uh, the different priorities that you want to, you know, make. So that means sorting two or more variables. All right. So uh, if you had to take a look at this particular data sets that we have down here this data set actually shows um, the 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 songs that has appeared this year in 2017 in my own top 20 charts and i saw it in terms of uh, uh, points okay uh, total number of points that a particular song actually chalk up in my in my top 20 chart and the thing is that i want to do priority sorting so what do i mean by that i want to sort first thing first in terms of points and then in terms of the number of weeks in which this song appears in my chart itself so uh, why do i do that is because if you were to look at row number 10 and row number 11 um, these two songs itself have the same number of points but uh, the number of times in which it appears in the chart is different so i want to consider okay uh the fact that if let's say a, a song or two songs itself have the same number of points uh, the number of weeks will take the next priority which means that if you have if a song um uh, uh, is in the chart for more weeks than the other it will be ranked higher so i want to do a priority sorting so how do i go about doing that basically what you will do is you click on this thing called the sort button so when you click on sort all right you can see uh in this uh in this box down here so first thing was i want to sort based on points because points is the most uh, relevant and sorting it in terms of largest sort of us. then subsequently i add a level so if you were to look at this thing down here it will first actually sort by points then by the next priority variable so in this case i will put um, the number of weeks that the songs appear in my chart itself as the next priority so same thing for largest to smallest then i click ok so as i click ok watch out for row number 10 and row number 11 so i can as you can see in the end this row number 10 and row number 11 actually sort in a sense that uh the Num uh, the songs that appears the, the most number of weeks in the chart itself it's on top of and the other one okay uh, even though they are chalk up the same number of points and um, you can also do priority sorting for for you know in the third case whereby you know if if let's say uh, you have two songs that has the same number of points and same uh, number of weeks appearing on the chart itself but uh, it picks at different positions in the chart so you can actually do a priority sorting in this case so yep and that's it uh, in this video and uh, if you guys have any questions do comment in the comment section below and i will see you guys in the next episode goodbye guys